to uh, the second hour of the uh, recording session. Now, for this one, I'm doing the Devil on G Strength, eh? which frankly I I enjoyed enjoyed it a lot while playing the at uh, the first time around. Around so just like it was actually one of my favorite games while playing this. Uh, now there is a warning, so I'm not sure if the if this let's play thing will be a lot loud since it said like recording. So I'm not sure if that's like voice recordings or if it means like like all record recordings like even let's play videos are copyright for them so um yeah i'm just gonna s hope that it's like audio recordings and and because frankly i won't uh, i can't tell if it's like like audio or visual recordings because in all honesty i haven't seen any like cutscenes however i also so have it like then there's also like the voice thing so which frankly i'm playing it the unvoiced one so uh, mainly because this is my desktop so it's like oh you're going to try to record or or the game set so with this, so uh, yeah. By the way, you won't be able to record, record your reactions. Then it's like, uh, yeah. I would rather have reactions and and actually be talking rather than have the game sound, because the game sound is irrelevant uh, compared to like reactions. So, um. Anyway, let's get this thing started. So. Um. Uh, uh, now supposedly this is about a uh, like like supposedly a this is about like supposedly a this is uh about a well the son of a gangster really. Uh, so like one of the, like one of the Godfather type people. Oh, uh, so yeah. Uh, um, that one I find like that's pretty much what I found interesting. And supposedly he also knows what he wants really. A uh, and a lot of times it always had to get it. So. At least I think that's how it's described. Frankly, uh, I really liked it. So, um, if it wasn't for the fact that like I never really had the uh, uh, amount for it, yet. and I'll honestly, I probably would have bought it for like full price. Uh, so to be fair, I also probably would have bought it for full price. Uh, it's a lot sooner. If I had no, known that I could easily spend like three hours and still be in the the prologue, it's only late late October yet. One can already feel the brisk northern air of wind. I oh, sorry, the brisk northern wind blowing by. The road gradually losing its color as, with the setting of the sun. At the corner of the large building, inside an empty alleyway, pieces of fallen leaves dance elegantly in the wind. Narrowing their eyes to prevent dust from blowing in, the people on the streets uh, scurry to their homes. It kind of seems like a poem, though to be fair, that could just be how I'm reading it. Mao raised his eyebrows as he watched the passing pedestrians, as if sensing the coming winter. His long periods of translucence was coming to an end. To perform a white collared crime, one must both be meticulously conceived and boldly to execute a perfect plan. The time, the place, the necessary sacrifices must be thoroughly thought out beforehand. And in order to achieve this perfection, Mao has spent many years in planning. 
And Mao wishes to kindle a power struggle within the city, a struggle to control the oceans of common men. And, and just as the winter in this oceans will always flow downward, the weak will always surge forward by the will of the strong. Therefore, to rule these seas of men, he will simply have to over uh, use overwhelming power, and several oh u useless and, and otherwise easily manipulative of minions to do it. Yet, if it becomes necessary in achieving his goals, Mao will not hesitate to interrupt uh, this torrential current. A sane man will probably dismiss his motives, believe them to be mere justifications for his criminal of his criminal acts. Still, even though people call him a devil, hence devil on G-string, and there are some that share his beliefs. As proof, Mao has already found um, both the necessary money and children to work as his underlings. These children, young adults, really, are not simply crucial actors in the upcoming criminal performance, but also his loyal followers. The battle will soon begin. My father, my father, the devil is out there. Er. Uh, er. Uh, and there's, er, uh, and that classic thing. Walking on a busy, flourishing street, the young girl felt awed by the sight. When she was a child, the streets aids did not have four lanes, and the buildings were not as high as mountains. However, in this day of age, her size disappeared quickly amongst the sounds of people walking through the intersection. The girl carried a wo worn brown suitcase. As within and the suitcase lies an expertly crafted violin. Grant Granted, its market value was nothing compared to a legendary instrument like the like a Stravis, but this violin was the girl's, girl's most prized possession. And she squeezed the handle tightly like, as her body gorged on emotion. And her mother's memento. Remembering her mother's death, her heart began to burn. Within herself with immutable uh, confidence lies an unwaveringly desire to fight. The girl kicks off the ground with incredible force. She will never give up, not until she's accomplished her goal, not until she defeats the devil with her own hands. And and that that does as. Uh, like with the, with that, just that, uh, that already made it more interesting the first time I read it. Well, it was doing it so. I forget if this one's a wait or a click. Wait, I guess. Yes. So this is the main character, I believe. Because uh, I believe that goes color. Like based off coloring, so I wake up up at seven every morning, and I got you, B, dude. I got I wake up at like I five or six, X, well five thirty or six thirty. Like it's either five five thirty or six thirty. I wake up usually one of those times. Definitely, if I'm in if I'm sleeping until seven, I'm definitely sleeping in. Um. Breakfast is always milk with toast. Yeah. At least he beats me most days on without. Like most days my breakfast is lunch. And and like every other day I open today's newspaper. Er uh, but despite all that routine, it was uh, only after looking through through my huge window and observing a city with more more than 10 million residents, I finally start to feel res ready for the day. Yes! Because uh, you cannot feel ready for the day until you go go observe serve a city uh, with over 10 million people that you can u use to in your plan to take over the country. <laughs> okay. Now it's time for school. And then you have to go to school. 
After everything I had to take care of these past three days, school seems much more interesting. Well, I'm ready to go. Huh? A visitor this early in the morning? I don't rem I remember making any appointments. Hello? The face on the screen looks familiar. Um, is this the Azai residence? Uh, and that, that's literally just like for the, uh, if you can see the music, I'm not sure. I, well, I guess that musical recordings could be what meant as well. Like, I, I, I'm not really sure, but basically if it's not me talking, it's copy, the copyright goes to, uh, Whoever made Devil on G-String. I forget who made it, though. I'll have to look it up. Uh, uh, and I would probably put it up if I remember that I said it. Probably won't, so... Oh, uh, yeah. The most I would do is probably just, like, put in the description say, saying... And, like, here's where... Where I got it from for those that are curious and want to buy it, like, most likely. Um, is this the Azai Resonance? And excuse me, but who are you? Yes, perfect response. Don't be fair, I probably would do that. That with like all of them except for maybe like NR, or uh, because in all honesty, with well, when I do like Crush and Fun, that's like NR, so. Oh, uh, with with NR stuff, it's like, eh, just whenever. There, so. Oh, um, I'm Mi Miwa, Miwa, uh, Subaki. I just call it Subaki, pretty much. Mm. Um, I'm a Z Zai QSA's classmate, well, the class representative. Funny how he does not even know the class representative. Oh, that's Tabaki. Hey, as he can. Uh, yeah, it's me. Didn't you notice? My income sh um, shouldn't have signal quality issues. I find it funny how she couldn't identify it. You sound different. I thought you may be, you might be your father. Uh, really? What the? Screw you. <laughs> uh, uh, well, don't worry about it. I apparently forgot you, too. Uh, Hey, you're kidding, right? Haven't we been in the same class since our first year? No, I'm not kidding. It seems like I'm not fully awake yet. Yeah, of course. Anyways, why are you here? Er, well, you've been sick these past few days, right? So I was, like, wondering what happened to you. Everything's fine now, so tell you what. I'll be right down. Let's walk to school together. All right. She is way too happy about that. Sabaki sounded pretty happy. Uh. Uh, morning. Sabaki is one of those people that improves your spirit just by being around her. This is my first time I've seen where you live. It's so amazing. Amazing? It, isn't this one of those luxury apartments? I've seen them on TV before. They say only rich people live in these complexes. Well, I guess it is big for only for just one person. What? You live alone? I'm a man of wealth and taste after all. I smile wearily. You live in the Eastern District, right? And you will soon be, be sleeping over at my house. And by the way, no, I do not. That's That would be me actually calling it. Because yeah, in all honesty, I I haven't seen it. Like, so, like I think that eventually there would be like a slumber party. I'm not sure where that would be, though. Oh, uh, so. Well, F it is. Is because I think that there's like train card for for this that's like some party one. So I think there may be multiple some parties in all honesty. Uh, not like I would know anything about it though, about it being in this game though. Oh, uh, because in all honesty, I've o I only played like uh like I think I just barely got into like chapter one. So yep, the city here is really modernized, but there's nothing and but fields out by me. Oh, uh, that's kind of sad. Then it should be nice and quiet, right? Well, a lot of foreigners show, showed up recently, so it's a little uh, more busy than usual these days. They're building a ski resort out there, right? People all uh, rave about the snow quality I hear, so it's getting a lot of 
publicity in Australia. Supposedly, it's going to be quite the tourist, tourist attraction. Ah, uh, yeah. The value of real estate out there is is about one hundred hundred thousand. I say one hundred forty thousand sand yen per square yard, right? Uh, but then again, the developers are using a general contractor, so no matter how many hotels and restaurants they build, it won't benefit the restaurant the residents too much. Yeah, and no, I'll honestly it probably wouldn't. So. Um, uh, mm-hmm. Uh, there's no point in talking to Tsubaki about this. You seem kind of rich. I am made of wealth and taste, after all. What do you expect? Just get it through your head that I'm made of ta wealth and taste. Ace, that's all you need to know for everything that, uh, that I need, need to say. I do not need to keep repeating it. Why do I... I shouldn't need to repeat it against you. You should have it in your head. Uh, either... Either that or you should have it in your notes. So you, I'm a man of wealth and taste. I am writing this in my di diary. As he is rich. Exactly. Hey, uh, but no, you forgot. You forgot to say As he is a man of of wealth, wealth and taste. He's a man of. It needs to. It doesn't need to be. You need to remove rich and put wealthy and taste. Well, a man of. Wealth and taste. That's what it needs to be. Uh, Sabaki holds the red book close to her, to her chest as if it were a treasure. It is her treasure, pre pretty much. That diary is like a part of his skin. Is there some specific reason you carry it around all day? Yeah, I, I think so. Riding, riding. <laughs> Listen to me. I arrived at Asikun's apartment in, at 7 in the morning. It's unbelievably swanky. Today is a beautiful day. Period. That's the thing that annoys me most about her, though. Uh, it's like, do you literally have to write everything that you're writing? And I mean, it's good if you want, if somebody wants, to, if you, if I, uh, if you would want to cheat off her. Not like I would, but still, uh. You don't need to freaking say everything that you're writing. And even though, of course, we would, we wouldn't even know know what she was writing. But still, you don't need to say period. Because it's like period, period. And as that sentence. And we better go to. Uh, we better hurry to school. We finally be in an art track. Track to school together. Er. Uh, er. Uh, after a short 15 minute walk, we arrived before the gates. Uh, this school is known as uh, Surai's Psyche School. Still, oh, sorry about butchering that name for anybody that's watching this and is like Japanese or something like that. That or has some. Or it has something to do with that. Like, I'm sorry if I said it wrong. As its name suggests, as the school advocates freedom for its students. Many unique students attend here. There are even uh, quite a few artisans and ten idols. On the other hand, students here can easily graduate, even if they don't concentrate on their academics. That's why uh, many people just think this is a flimsy art school with no substance. And yeah, uh, uh, so like probably only game design would be good for that. Though to be fair, fair like with game design, it's just like barely just need experience. That's pretty much it. Uh, uh, like you barely need to like code for the like, game design, and so. Yeah, like, to be a game designer, you pretty much just, like, of everything in the process, you pretty much just need to know a little bit about it. It's not, not really, uh, too much to, though. Uh, so, yeah. You know, as he comes often absent from class, his sister is gone a lot, too, but that's because she has to participate in figure skating competitions. But as he should be, uh, just like me, a just a regular student. 
Uh, no. He's not. He's much better than you. Uh, he can't be just a regular student. He's a devil. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, it's like... Like, seriously. Haven't you read the title of this thing? Hmm, Asuka is a mysterious person, isn't he? Period. That should be a question mark. Uh, I don't really understand what's going on, but apparently the explanation over the s of the school is over. Hey, Subaki. Oh, sorry, was I muttering out loud? <laughs> uh, it's still kind of like that face. Not as much as the one that had, uh, like, the white eyes in the first hour, though. That still is a kind of funny face, so. Uh, I think I had a better reaction to that uh, the first time, though, though, so, like, if I can ever figure out how to get that, uh, done, I probably will. Um, about my emphasis, didn't I tell you about that before? Uh, oh, that was because of it, uh, of illness, right? That's not what I said. Sabaki tilted her head. I'm absent because I help out my papa with work. Sometimes I even take business trips out of the country. Um, ah. Well, I guess technically he does do that in all honesty. Uh, so. Uh, yeah. Uh, and I need to go racing soon, so. Uh, though, to be fair, that's one good reason about recording. I, like, like that's why I probably would more, what would rather record for 24 hours rather than like stream for 24 hours because like stream for 24 hours it's like yeah that that's pretty much like the same as like recording for 24 hours or is but it's gone up immediately they okay. however this time this it basically makes it so that I don't have to find a day that literally I can spend nothing but recording will do nothing but record for about uh 24 hours. As I can just like I can just do like the recordings around it. Still won't sleep until after I'm done though, but still. Oh, that's beside the point. Uh this is the first time I've heard you say this. Really? Uh I swear I'm sorry sorry of it because I'm right everything and I know about you in my diary. That's kind of stalkerish, actually. Somehow that sounded a bit creepy. It, you can't forget stalkerish. If that's even a word, I think it. I think it. If nothing else, we'll make it a word. We'll make stalkerish a word. word. Which is basically a, a qual somebody showing. Uh, well, something similar to like a stalker, like showing qualities of, like an action, action or person showing quality, qualities of being a stalker. <laughs> You're writing this down too. Oh, Asikan calls his father Papa the way Westerners do. Period. What's wrong with that? Even and Honokawa says it like that. Uh, Honokawa san Oh, the guy in that anime. Hokama Silen is my idol. Mm, I think I'm starting to get in the groove. Good morning. Uh, oh, hey, Yachi. Oh, yes, Mr. Hyde. This is, that is, he was, easy what, what, Yachi Kun. As you can see, he's your typical pretty boy. He even wears short, shorts, er, it's, he wears shorts even in the winter. He's very popular among older women and, and also a good friend of mine, period. I'm once again in the dark here, but apparently she's done done on the explaining of the near character too. Er and once again we get the fourth wall break. Uh, uh gosh, the temperature just keeps dropping. Last night I even got to hope it being it would snow today. Uh, a cute puppy, be like smile appeared on his face. Uh, hey, Subaki Chan, did you read the new issue of Kyun Kyun on uh, yesterday? Kyun Kyun is a popular women's fashion magazine. 
Um, no, not yet. <sighs> How about I lend it to you then? And this month they ran a special on perfumes. Um, oh, and one of the columns mentioned uh, the new candy store in the Western District. Uh, hopefully I don't get, get like, told, like, hopefully I don't just, like, wear, wear myself out due to this, because in all honesty, it's, like, I, it's not even a week since the last one ended, uh, but I'm already, like, re-recording, and the entire thing, uh, and of course, just, like, since I'm processing the 22nd hour still, uh, I will, when I, Whenever I need to pause it to do something, I will probably unpause it from processing. That way, I'm all this computer is always doing something and related to this. Yes, and then so that I don't like waste time because I know that I'll have to process this, as well as a race for Saturday, uh, within the next couple of days. Like the race needs to pr be processed. As uh, like, and nothing else tomorrow, cause just like, well, oh, uh, like it should be processed like, like Thursday night, so that I can process, so I can upload it Friday. Okay, race is done. Uh, well, I'm done with the race. The ra race isn't done specifically, but I had my first case of a random blow up. Uh, like, seriously, like, I was just driving, then suddenly blow, blown up, and then just, like, somebody was getting mad at me for blowing up for some odd reason. Or at least, seeming like it was getting mad, but, oh well. Uh, like, frankly, like, I don't care, because, just, like, if they want to keep getting mad at me for that, it's just, like, I'll just keep saying, it was a random blow up, I had no indication. And in fact, my my brother, who knows more about uh, like the NASCAR cars, said it was also a random. He also said it was a random blow blow up because just like he saw onboard, which had pretty much what I saw with the gears. There's no indication. I just blew up. Uh, thing is, the bad side about that was I was like running second and and I had led a lap so I ex so like that was one of the ones that I probably would have done like good or at least decent with and then that just happened and it's like GG eh. oh well uh, I forget if I said this uh, so sorry if I said it and just forgot to go on how about I lend it to you then? This month they ran a special uh, perfumes. Oh, and one of the columns mentioned the new candy store in the western dis in the western district. Mm. Yet she knows a lot about popular women's topics because he's a girl. Yes, he has to be a girl. Girl in guys' clothing. That's that's the only reason why he can know a lot about popular girls' topics. Yet she can don't take this the wrong way, but you're even cuter than me. That's because he's a girl in a guy's body. You, you, he can't take it the wrong way if he's a girl on the on the inside. I probably should stop that right there. He, so you think I'm feminine? No, we think you're a girl. Oh, uh, completely on the inside, or at least I do. Uh, that's a good thing. That that makes you really easy to talk to. Oh, uh, and well. It makes it really easy to talk to by girls. It was really hated by guys. Or at least most guys. Uh, well, thank you. I think th this every time, but Iachi's smile always looks perfect. Uh, oh, I almost forgot. Iachi once again flashes his bright uh, white teeth. It's, I heard there will be a transfer student starting today. In our class? At this time of year? She's probably some new idol who moved here for her debut. It's not that unusual to transfer here in the middle of the school year. Uh, 
it's a girl. I hope she's a cute one. And just, I just hope she comes to class every day. People are so busy towards the end of the year, so there's no one to talk to in class. Yeah, there's this guy, guy that you would love to talk to, but he's always so busy at the end of the year that you never get the chance to talk to him. Or am I wrong on that? I think Canon is coming today. Uh, oh, really? She's already back from the U.S.? Can I? Actually, I just got the message last night. Uh, she's really something else. She might even make the next Olympics. Well, that all depends on how she how uh, she does between now and then. I swear Canon is a root. Oh. Oh. I would not be pissed if there isn't one, but I also would not be surprised if there is one. And the reason why I wouldn't be pissed is because she's like she's not the blood related sister, or but uh, like she's supposedly a sister to him. So like, I I know that there's one person that at least that says like the not blood related thing and. On like the sister, which makes it kind of okay, is pretty much just like a cop out. Uh, which, in all honesty, I kind of agree with it because just like you're just like avoiding the issue of it being incest. Because uh, like it's like yeah, I can understand like being married to like well having. Having them be like ses stepsisters or something like that, that a little bit, but not really, because like these, it still would be kind of like incest, because like incest is more like a term for for when you're like like related to the people. So yeah. Uh. Mm. So Kanan Chin's back. I really wanted to see her again. It sounds like she's waiting for her lover. What a sweet girl. Oh, oh! I almost forgot. The teacher asked me to see see her this morning. Now that's the kind of stuff you should write in your you should remember to write in your diary. Hey, sorry, I've got to go. Um, see you later. Sabaki dashed into the school building. Um. Iyaki and I just stared at each other for for a while. Iyaki, quick, staring contest. Uh, I can't do it. Damn it, you won. <laughs> uh, damn it. My reaction is exactly. I wanted to beat you in the staring contest, but you, but you're too good at stare, staring, and so oh, you beat me. Uh, what? Damn that little bee. Huh? What's with that? Don't take this the wrong way, but you're implying... But you're even implying in cure than me. Um, what is she even trying to imply? That you're a girl in a guy's clothing. Let's say... Uh, that you're a girl in a guy's body. Uh, oh, come on. She didn't mean anything bad by it. Yeah. Uh, me cute, don't be ridiculous, dude. What the hell? You are laughing with her, weren't you? I'm so uh, be being pissed. If you, if I weren't two years younger, I would totally mount her. Be <laughs> well, kid. She's our friend, right? You've got to think about screwing her. At least think about about doing it gently. I so say, if you got to think about screwing her, or at least think about doing it gently. Family, friends, whatever, mate. Man, it doesn't even beeping matter. I'm beeping in sight. Uh, a beeping sight when I, and to see my snap. Just kill. I just kill everyone in sight. What an idiot. This one I will definitely remember to try to remember to censor. Er, this is also one reason why I like I like record. Why I like uh recording over streaming. Because then it allows me to, like, censor things a little bit. Because uh, just, like, pretty much anybody that, like, 
no, knows the words. Or it's in which I want care if they were seeing them. Um, would be able to piece it together literally a very easily just by like the first letter, and the fact that it's censored. Er, uh, er, uh, the only reason why I censor it is because like, like I actually ha have no problem with cussing, and. In fact, even if I see somebody, that, like even if I see cussing in the game before, I actually they uh, start playing it. Uh, I would be like, oh well, I'll just continue playing it. Yeah, uh, I w I won't stop just because it's like uncensored. I will just I'll just try to censor censor it uh, after I've finished it, like. That's literally all that it means. Anyway, let's get back to it, doing this. Find the bell rings. Yeah, I guess I, I will be fooling around, around with the stupid again today. Is you uh, well, can I please hurry to the classroom? Yes, coming. And I like how he immediately he goes... Like how fast he can transform between Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Uh, like seriously, that's amazingly fast. Like that was an incredibly fast personality switch. He actually's got to be bipolar. Like, uh, uh, I, like I do not not understand how you'd be able to be like this if he wasn't bipolar. Hey. Uh, like, if you, just, if you told me he was not bipolar, there, uh, I would say just, like, how, how, how is he not, like, like, he literally goes as, and pretty much means exactly what he says, and he, he can do, like, two different things entirely. Like, like. There are about 30 students in this class. Five are absent today. Uh, Shira Tori San didn't come today. Uh, and Shira Tori uh, has got to be important because she's like, like she's actually one of the people. She's one. She has a name. Uh, nope. Whoops. Uh, almost seriously did something bad there. Uh, anybody with... Uh, always in visual novels, if somebody has a name, they've got to be important. Even if it's question mark, question mark, question mark. Uh, are you guys good with... Sh uh, good friends with Shia Tori Sam? Or at least if they have... Uh, like if they have question mark, question mark, question mark, well, three question marks with a face, then... They're important. Not really. Why do you ask? If then, why do you care if she's absent or not? Well, I kind of like to be your friend too. That's great. Shiratori, Shiratori, uh, Mizuwa. Even though I forgot a lot of stuff, that's the one girl I need to take note of. Unfortunately, she's not here today. Then I realized how noisy the hallway was. What's going on? Good morning. Um. Oh, Kinon Chan. The classroom immediately becomes livelier following Kinon's arrival. Uh, hey, yeah, uh, how is everyone? Sweet steps of you really are quite loud. Um, uh, and that's pretty much what I mean. Like, I. I still view the oh, the stepsister as like incest, though, even if they are not blood related. Well, actually, te well, I still view uh, like a stepsister as being like incest, uh, or well, incestuous. It's like sister and stepsister, it's both incestor, incestuous, as well as brother and stepbrother, uh, like, uh, I, like, long time no see, Cameron. Canon Chin, how was Canada? Uh, huh, Canada? Well, 
It felt like he had a perfect description. Uh, just like the U.S. feels felt like the U.S. This. 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 That is as an A plus description. Shit, if I've ever heard one about Canada. The two fair, I haven't really heard much about Canada anyway, so yeah, not like I can really give something. Sweet stepsister, you clearly, you really are quite airheaded. Yeah, that pretty much sounds like her. I, I see. But, but I learned the quad jump there. She has a smug look on her face. Uh, it's amazing. I heard only a few people in the world can execute a quad jump. Uh, but, but I fall on my butt where I'm, when I land. That's not executing it, then. Don't say you learned it. You can't say you learned something if you k keep failing at it. Once that you, uh, like if you, like with fear seating, if you, uh, fall down when you try to execute something, that's not learning it. That's just... As having an idea on how to learn it. Well, actually, I guess it would be learning it. Uh, it's not executing it properly to use it in a competition, but still. You know, she still has a smug look on her face. Uh, I, I, I see. <laughs> uh, Nissan, Nissan. What? Why are you so excited? Uh, can I spend the night at your place today? Huh? I was stunned for a second. Uh, ah, so it started back up already. Ken Chan's acting like a spoiled kid again. Ken Chan really loves her brother. Yes, to a point that's incestuous, I think. And I, I think that would be like incestuous, uh, like an incestuous way. I'm not, I'm not sure, but. So can I? Can I? Hold it right there. Today's a bad day. Well, in day's bad day. Uh, why? Don't keep looking at me with those eyes. Why, why, why? What's the problem? Um, it's a fact that I'm gonna have a lady over there, so you will just be in the way. <laughs> hey, you say she's got you cornered. I think I just saw an evil smile pop on Bon Iechi's face. Why? Because there's only one bed in my house. So we can sleep together. Oh my God! Really? Uh, so I'm not sure what to make of that. Still, oh, I I believe I cringed the first time, and I believe I'm cringing now. Oh, uh, I am not sure. Uh, hey now. I think you're missing something here. Think about it. A non-blood-related brother and sister sharing the same bed. What is this? Some third-rate race soap opera? No, it's a third-rate visual novel. Get it right. It's not a soap opera. It's a visual novel. Uh, you have to be, be specific, huh? Right, Iachi? You tell her. Uh, I I'm too innocent to not think like that. <laughs> Uh, perfect way to get out of it. Way to go, Yechi. Screw you as well. Ew. Look, you just can't. Go go home in, um, like you usually do. Papa wants to see you too. Uh, don't wanna. Now what? But just at the moment, as if God had interviewed, my cell phone rang. Oh, Asukun, you should uh, carry his cell phone to school. I told you, uh, it's... Just be quiet, it's uh, Tsubaki. Like seriously, just you're. The rules are irrelevant at at this point, and to this guy. Like seriously, uh, I ignored her and answered the phone. So I think that like uh like in the U.S. I find it, it kind of cool how like a cell phone is not illegal, but uh many people break the law in this, and that. A phone with a camera is not allowed. Um, like most people have like smartphones which have cameras, so that's that's itself is illegal. However, like a uh, like as long as the phone doesn't have a uh 
camera, it's actually a legal, uh, and perfectly legal to actually have it on. Uh, well, on during school hours, or on your person during school hours. You're not supposed to have it on during class time, mind you, but still, it's legal uh, to have it on you. Hello? Oh, hi, Miki-chan. I had a lot of fun at the park the other day. Uh, huh? Eh? Yeah, I'm at school right now. What? Really? You want to do it again sometime? So do I. Who is it? His friend, right? As as I can seems to have a lot of friends outside of school. Uh, Kiyosu kun so popular, is he? What a lucky guy. Hmm? Sure, I'll call you again and later. Alright, bye. After the constipation, I looked at Kana. Who was it? Just a little friend of mine. Little? She's your old friend. Well, not exactly. It's hard to describe my relationship with Mickey chan And now I'm mad. While you were a Kana, you changed into a completely different person. Come on now. Don't be like that. You know what they say. You're supposed to have fun while you're young. Um... Uh, so you're just having fun with her? I never knew you were such a heartless person. Yeah, yeah, you kind of just dig yourself a hole here. Uh, I for yeah, as I, uh, as I, uh, you're just, you're just, just quit digging yourself a hole. Oh, uh, I, as I has a girlfriend, I didn't know at all. No, that wasn't my girlfriend. How many times does he have to say it? I didn't know either, but hey, introduce her, her to us next time. What is wrong with you, too? Uh, she... What part about she's not my girlfriend do you two not understand? You... Do you... Does anything this guy says as mean anything to you? You too. I thought it meant something to you, but oh, you... I thought you just didn't care. Uh, so you are... You are, um, like, half expecting, half not. Uh, so, yeah. Oh. Uh, uh, you better watch your back, Nissan. What, what for? Uh, whatever, I don't care anymore. Uh, turning her head, she sulked back to her seat. Uh, wow, that's a shock. Azikan already has a girlfriend, period. Once again, you don't need to say everything. Like, like... This this visual novel has the funny parts, but in all honesty, it does make me cringe from time to time. The fact that she says everything that she writes in her diary, that makes me cringe. And the, inc the incestuous ones, like, oh, uh, uh, really? That's it? Uh, like, like... Uh, so to be fair, this could be a kind of sec once I just like am reading this. Like, I'm not sure if there's a choice or if there is. When is it? Ah, uh, school really is great. It's so comfortable. Uh, yes, very very interesting as well. Oh, uh, hey Yachi, what now? Class is going to start without the transfer student. Yachi is sitting in the at the back of the class reading a magazine instead of his textbook. Yes, of course, because every, every single uh, uh, pretty boy needs to be reading a magazine instead of a textbook. Hmm, that's strange. Are you sure she's coming today? I heard it from um, Noriko-chan, so it's definitely legit. Noriko-chan is a teacher at the school. Supposedly, she's in some sort of relationship with the Echi, but I doubt it. Why, you interested? I'm always interested in women. I'm always interested in women. Uh, God, quit pitching attendance school. I'm oh, sorry, God, man, quit pitching attendance school. Well, well, it's tough being a transfer student, right? She won't know her way around. She might have trouble making friends. You know what I'm talking about. So, so she'll be easy to seduce. You really are Mr. Hyde. No. You're, well, eh. Well, you're Mr. Hyde and Mr. Jekyll, to be fair. So, I don't want to hear... Hear that, Mr. Hyde, coming from you. I don't want to hear that from you, but I'll take it as a compliment. Yeah, exactly. Uh, when it comes to women, Iechi and I always uh, have always seen eye to eye. Oh, Kyuse, uh, have you seen my pencil? Yes, uh, Iechi looks all over the desk uh, for it. You ever heard of a guy named Newton? <laughs>
Uh, yes, yes. Who? Isaac Newton. I'm Isawa Iachi. Yes, yes, you are, but your pencil is under your desk. Uh, I can see myself doing that. It's just like, I, if somebody uh, is asking, like, hey, where's my pencil? It's just like, Newton. And and then it's just like, what why, What does Newton have to do with it? Anything. And then just like they looked at it's like oh <laughs> oh uh, so like to my friends that uh, like I have classes with that's yeah, provided that they're watching this which I'm questioning if they would uh, the, do not be surprised if I use this in fact I will be I'll be I'll find it so funny if my friend if one of my friends actually is here watches this, and I still get him on it. Who's Isaac? A famous person. Like some new mobile suit person or something? No, he's a famous physicist. My favorite person is Fugisawa uh, Yukichi. Yeji! Hey, are you so freaking idiot, idiotic that you do not remember the person who discovered gravity? Like, seriously. Uh, because you like money? No way, bro. Don't you think he's really cool? How is he cool? Would you mind sharing with the class? He was an amazingly fair person. He said a lot of amazing things. He was totally amazing. The only thing I understood uh, was the word was that you over overused the word amazing. Whatever. The guy was effing amazing. Um, but now a company ever hired Iachi, he would run them into the ground. Of course, I also love money. And so it's about money after all. Uh... Oh, I guess uh, this class ended while we were talking. Even though this happens every time, our classes are really feel feeling more and more, uh, aren't they? Every every day, aren't they? Fugisawa, you you get G. Oh, I just realized it. Okay, F U Zawa. Hmm. I, I totally forgot about that name. That name got me both times. Like, oh my god, wow, GG on that. Uh, like, it took me, it actually separated it out for me to realize, oh, yeah. Uh, it's still October, so the rooftop is quite cold. Uh, aren't you going to eat can and chin? And I'm on a diet. For figure skaters, it seems like even one extra pound could cause balance problems during jumps. Um, so are you just eating junk food again, Iachi Kun? Well, of course! He has to eat, eat junk food! Well, I can survive off chocolate alone. I don't know if that's part of his innocent image, but I've never seen him eat anything but sweets. It's as he kind of is talking on his cell phone. Even during breaks, I need to spend my time on the phone. Yes, of course, because I have to go and talk to everybody and also be controlling each and every single political figure, figure because I need to be a little puppet ma master steer, and be controlling every single wor little person in the world dude, from the shadows. <laughs> And frankly, I just said what his entire thing is. Uh, looks like I'll be eating alone again. Sabaki so sadly opened her little lunchbox and began to eat. Ah. Uh, uh, so you finished talking? Uh, who was on, on the phone? Seems like Ken's moon and had, hasn't improved since this morning. Don't get the wrong impression. I was just calling your new maid, Ken. Uh, maid? Yeah, her name is is Kojima. She's a very a affable person. Why did you get me a maid? Pop asked me to. He said the house will will be a lot noisier after you're back. Uh, oh, I get you. Since I've practiced today, today I'll be home late. Uh, I'll, if I see her, I'll be sure to say hi. Uh, where does your family live? In the southern district. Sabaki looked bewildered. Um, wait, then why do you, do you live by yourself? I have to be close to school, right, Nissan? Well, actually, I'm out of it in the mornings. Yet she whispered beside me. Uh, more like it, 
uh, it's so you can bring women back. Yechi! That's the truth, but you shouldn't say that! Uh, what? Eh? Did you say something, Yechi Kun? No, he did not! Uh, mm, chocolate tastes so good! <laughs> yes, exactly! That's totally what you said! Let's just go with that! One of these days I'm gonna teach this kid let's see he'll never forget. Uh, I like how many different ways I can react to this stuff, uh, if even if I read it before. Huh? I point out a person without thinking. What? Wow, her hair is so long. More like it's very thick. Like, she's staring at us. Well, I guess you could say we're staring at her too, but she's been staring at us for a while now. To be more precise, she's been staring at me. Who is she? I've never seen her before. That's because you don't usually come to school. So you know who she is? No, I don't. You know, don't you think you think she's an underclassman? At that moment, yet you raised his hand excitedly. Oh, I got it! I got it! Got what? The true identity of the girl with the long hair. He has a smiley look on his face. My cell phone rang. Oh, sorry, another call again. Don't get get mad. It's the same person. Oh, the main. Oh, I guess it's fun. On the other end, the line is an old lady's voice. Oh hi, your Koji's uh, some uh, your Kojima's sound, right? Damn it, Kenan uh, is annoying sometimes. She's been following me around since we were kids. Uh, I think I'm the only person in the school without a cell phone. Um, it's not like we enforce the rules here. Uh, listen to me. It's Iechi. It seems Iechi really wants to tell us something about the girl with the long hair. Hmm. After giving the maid some simple directions, I hung up the phone. Hey. A uh, voice spoke up from behind me. Huh? Uh, I turned around. A large pair of eyes stared at, at me from behind a long, thick, living creature of hair. It was alive, wasn't it? Huh? I so clear that one could uh, fall into them. You said she was an affable person, right? I saw a faint smile from the corner of her lips. So what are you trying to say? Uh, you said the maid was an awful person, but the next time you picked up the phone, you said you're Kojima. Uh, sorry, Kojima. Uh, sound right? I kept my mouth shut. Uh, in other words, that was the first time you talked to the maid, maid called Kojima. If so, how do you, you how do you know that she's an affable person? And conclusion: You are not talking to the maid the first time. Who is this girl? Um, Azekan, this is... Huh? Huh? The two... These two still don't get it. Am I invisible or something? I said listen to me. Uh, wait, that make makes that three. I'm not sure what you're trying to apply, but the person who recommended her told me about her affable personality. Uh, I see. Can it be this weird... Is this weird girl? She's a transfer student. Um... Uh, yes, of course. Uh, mm, the transfer student who was later on first day stands before the class. Uh, she keeps looking down at the floor. All right, could you? Would you care to introduce yourself? As the class representative, Subaki organized this introduction. Eh? You don't have to be nervous. How about turning your name first? Ah, uh, um, she doesn't seem to be motivated. My my name? She muttered in a voice that was hard to pick up. She's a weird, we, she's a weird girl, isn't she? Her hair is so long. She's got a strange air about her. Feeling awkward, Sabaki tried to ask again. Yeah, your name? Do I, do I really have to say it? Well, sure you do. If you, if you didn't, we wouldn't know what to call you, would we? Hi, indeed. She keeps sighing. I am Bid Laden. What? You don't know my name? She doesn't know us. I'm Bid Laden. You, and of course. Uh, of course, she doesn't know Osama Bin Laden. That you obviously have to be Osama Bin Laden, right? Or at least he's his daughter. Uh, she seems to be quite angry. What? And what? In she's so weird. Her hair is so long. Uh, beads of sweet. I uh, uh, sorry, beads of sweat appear on Sabaki's forehead. Just look, please. Just my name, right? Yeah, I used to be called Hero. Huh? Hero? I mean, like, if you had to say, uh, if people had to say, Hey, Hero, go buy some Hero bread or something like that, at, I would, it would just crack you up, right? 
Uh, and please like, comment, subscribe if you guys enjoyed uh, this as much as I have. Of well, in this hour as much as I have. Of uh, I will see you guys for the third hour. Hour right after this.